this video you will learn how you can make an intermittent wiper controller which is a very useful circuit if you have a vehicle that does not have an intermittent wiper and you'd like to have one or you have a vehicle that has an intermittent wiper and the intermittent wiper no longer works properly you can replace the circuit with this one here the schematic is very simple it only consists of a few resistors a couple of transistors a capacitor a relay, a diode, and a potentiometer. It's fully adjustable on the delay with this potentiometer right here, which is a 500K pot. You can also use this intermittent wiper controller as an intermittent flasher if you would like. All right, so now we're going to take a look at the circuit. I have a 12 volt power supply running it right now. Now the relay has been replaced by this orange LED to show you the delay. Now by turning it clockwise, I will increase the delay. Let me do it a couple of turns. Stop. Now you see it's going to slow down. You see there's a longer delay now in between. If I turn it more, we get an even longer delay. If I turn it more, get an even longer delay. Let's try that. On now, off. Okay, now let's try going backwards a little bit. Let's speed it up. Let's go counterclockwise. Let's go a little faster here. So you can adjust the speed whatever you want. You could have fixed resistor settings. So if you don't want to be turning a knob, you can have three positions with three different resistor values. So you can get a fast, medium, and slow wiper speed. Or if you want to use this as a flashing circuit, you can have a slow, medium, and fast flashing circuit. The values of the capacitor and the resistors are not really critical. As long as they're close, you're OK. And how it's going to work, the wiper switch feeds power into the circuit, and then it will trigger the relay to close the contacts to supply power to the wiper motor.